like and subscribe right now or you're going to have bad luck for the rest of the week. When you think of the most dangerous predators hunting divers underwater, it doesn't surprise us if your answer would be sharks. Sure, we know some more, like the moray eel and electric eel, but our waters boast many more dangerous marine creatures that aren't so well known. From the cutest jellyfish around to the terrifying pufferfish, here are 10 dangerous sea creatures no one has told you about. Let's begin. Number 10. Box Jellyfish While they look innocent enough, box jellyfish happen to be one of the ocean's deadliest animals. The most dangerous member of this class of jellyfish are usually confined to the Indo-Pacific Ocean. Still, other less dangerous members can be found throughout the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans. From the box jellyfish class, it is the Chironix flecky, Karuka barnisi, and Mallow kingi species that are most venomous. Stings from these little cnidarians are extremely painful to humans and can be fatal if left untreated. Even less venomous species can still be potentially fatal to children. Their tentacles are packed with a harpoon-shaped microscopic injector, specifically adapted to inject venom into their prey on contact. Box jellyfish venom causes their prey cells to become porous, causing potassium leakage and eventually causes hyperkalemia. This can lead to heart failure and death can ensue as quickly as two to five minutes after exposure. Number nine, Kanduru. Kanduru, also known as the Vandela Kairosa, is like a fish you've never seen or heard of before. This is for good reason, a fish you should hope to never come across. These scaleless fish are found in the Amazon River. With a translucent color and eel-like body, these fish grow a mere one inch in length. Don't be fooled by their size, these fish can be deadly. You will likely not see them as they harbor in the gill cavities of larger fish, feeding on their blood. The kanduru has also been found to attack humans, and the worst part is that it is often unknown until after the fact. These fish swim up unexpected swimmers urethras. Once inside of you, the fish erects its short spines. This causes inflammation, hemorrhage, and can even cause untimely death. Number 8. Stonefish The next predator on our list has a camouflage beyond compare, which adds to its danger. If you happen to be a super venomous creature like the stonefish, let us introduce you to the stonefish, also known as the most venomous fish in the world. These fellas might not be more than 30 to 40 centimeters long, but they are living proof of the fact that you don't have to be great in order to be a threat. The venom of the stonefish can cause excruciating pain, temporary paralysis, and even heart failure. Good thing there are some pretty effective antidotes available, right? The reassuring fact for divers is that stonefish won't actually attack you. These creatures use their venom only as a defense mechanism and kill their prey with quick attacks instead. Number 7. Lionfish Lionfish is a highly invasive and predatory species that may also be referred to as the devil firefish. Many environmentalists have begun speculating that its arrival and migration may jeopardize the chances of other life forms in the sea. Sharks have been known to avoid them in the water because of their ability to cause fatal injuries. The lionfish has venom and injects it directly into the victim's bloodstream using a needle-sharp dorsal, pelvic, and anal fins. Ugh. These species are native to the Caribbean and eastern Atlantic, particularly the South Pacific and Indian Oceans. The potentially deadly fish has toxic barbs and an excruciatingly painful sting that may be capable of killing people. Although their fatalities are rare, most people come down with allergic reactions as well as extreme pain, vomiting, and respiratory paralysis. Ugh. No doubt the lionfish may look beautiful. They are just as venomous. The only positive may be that they do not lie in ambush, waiting for their prey and only sting under duress or defensive purposes. Number 6. Piranha Also called the Caribe or the Perea, the Piranha is another known fish that is very deadly. This carnivorous fish only grows to be about 2 feet in length, but it can have quite the bite thanks to its razor-sharp teeth. Found in the rivers and lakes throughout South America, the danger of these fish has mainly been sensationalized by the movie industry, specifically the movie Piranha, of course, consisting of 
of more than 60 species, most are scavengers or feed off plant material. Being either a black or silver color, these fish have a large blunt head with strong jaws. The red-bellied piranha is the most infamous for being lethal as they have the strongest jaws housing the sharpest teeth. This species can grow up to 20 inches and hunt in groups of more than 100. Piranhas, like sharks, are drawn to the smell of blood. Most species never kill large animals and piranha attacks on humans are very rare. Number 5. Stingrays Sometime in September 2016, the world woke to the news of the death of a famous crocodile hunter, Steve Irwin. He was known to seek and handle some of the most dangerous animals ever on this planet. And it was later discovered that Steve died from an attack of an Australian bull ray, one of the largest species of stingrays. Stingrays are generally considered rather conservative. They only attack in self-defense, and most of their attacks occur to the ankles and lower legs. Although stingray-related fatalities are extremely rare, particularly because the extraordinarily painful stings aren't usually deadly, Steve Irwin died because the stingray pierced his heart. Number 4. Sea Snakes Sea snakes, otherwise known as coral reef snakes, are a subfamily of venomous elliptid snakes and they inhabit marine environments for their greater part of their lives. They are among the most genetically diverse species and can be found in a majority of the tropical waters of the Pacific and Indian Oceans and are closely related to the venomous terrestrial snakes in Australia. Sea snakes are known to be extremely adapted to aquatic life and cannot move on land except the sea crates, a close relative which can move on land for a short time. They have paddle-like tails and a compressed body, giving them the appearance of an eel. Although they do not have a history of being aggressive, most of them bite when provoked, and their highly toxic venom is the reason they are on our list today. Barely three drops of their venom is enough to kill about eight people simultaneously. And although they would most likely choose to hide from humans, their venom is so powerful that they can get through even diver's suits. Number 3. Tiger Shark The tiger shark is a species of requiem shark. It is a large macro predator capable of attaining the length of over 5 meters. Populations are found in many tropical and temperate waters, especially around the Central Pacific Islands. Its name derives from the dark stripes down its body, which resembles a tiger's pattern but fades as the shark matures. The tiger shark is a solitary, mostly nocturnal hunter. It is notable for having the wide widest food spectrum of all sharks, with a range of prey that includes crustaceans, seals, squids, turtles, sea snakes, dolphins, and even other small sharks. This picture is also from an encounter between a tiger shark and a hammerhead shark. It is considered a near-threatened species due to finning and fishing by humans. The tiger shark is second only to the great white in recorded fatal attacks on humans. Number 2. Cone Snail Cone snails are small aquatic animals growing to barely 10 to 15 centimeters. They are usually found in the deep reef waters that flow from the Indian and Pacific Oceans down to the Caribbean and parts of Florida. This innocent-looking sea creature lives in its shell of brown black and white patterns, which further improves their facade of being inoffensive. However, this outer saint has an inner devil, and the cone snail, like other snail species, is slow. Surprisingly, their attacks are swift and potent. They use a sophisticated system to know where nearby swimmers are and use their beaks to sting. Unfortunately, this sting is painless for many human victims, as the venom possesses an analgesic, pain-eliminating property. Their venom is so highly potent that a single drop would suffice to kill 20 men. They are not aggressive chasers, but they spring on their victims, using their hollow teeth and injects their venom through it. They possess the nickname Cigarette Snail, probably because some environmentalists believe that once stung by a cone snail, the human victim has just about enough time to smoke a cigarette before dying. Number 1. Puffer That's right, this cute little fish made famous by Finding Nemo is actually quite dangerous. That is, if you try to eat them. Puffers, commonly called swellfish or blowfish, are an umbrella term for about 90 different fish species under the Tetradenontidae family. When threatened or stressed, these fish inflate themselves to a larger form. How they got their trademark puffer name. 
These fish frequent warm tropical ocean waters. They have, in some instances, been found in fresh waters, though. This is unlikely. Most puffers are quite small, with the largest species growing to be about 35 inches long. They have pricked skin and fused teeth. These fish are most often not used as food, as they contain a highly toxic tetrodotoxin in their internal organs. With that being said, these fish are still sometimes eaten in parts of Asia, specifically Japan. They can only be consumed when a specially trained chef is preparing and cleaning them. Which of these marine animals did you know about, and which ones do you think are the most dangerous? Let us know in the comments, and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.